Hi guys, hope you're all well. If you're new to Siege Studios, we're a premium miniature painting service with over 30 artists. Here at Siege we offer four painting levels, ranging from our bronze, premium gaming quality, up to our platinum competition standard. For your free quote today, follow the link in the description of this video. Hey guys, hope you're all well and welcome to this showcase video. Corn is going to be very happy after seeing this video, hopefully. Uh, we have the almighty Scarabrand uh, for you to check out today. This exquisite miniature has been painted by Adam, one of the artists here at Siege, and is at our platinum level. So I do hope you're going to like this one because the model is absolutely stunning. So make sure you watch all the way through to catch every little detail. Uh, red being my favourite colour, this model does not not disappoint. Uh, so let's jump in and have a look at Scarabrand in all of, of his aggressive glory. Uh, so right from the get-go you'll see that there's absolutely bucket loads of NMM or non-metallic metal that's been painted across this miniature on, on all of the weaponry, the chain, the axe, the armour, uh, absolutely everything um, and uh, it has been painted in a beautiful, beautiful sort of pinky red for his skin. Uh, there's loads of striation marks of stretched skin and sinew and a real sort of hide to him you'll see uh, just how really really cool Scarbrand is as a model with uh, half of this skull here just with obviously uh, the flesh just ripped off of that uh, face of his that long kind of bearded uh, sort of uh, sort of it's almost like a reverse top knot that he's got uh, on the on the sort of face as well which is awesome and again you've got that corn symbol as a braid at the end which is just great um, you've got this incredible axe just if we have a look at that uh, there you got this almost like a gum and the teeth just sticking out which I think is a beautiful way to actually paint the axe. Uh, really nice use of sort of a color to denote what that uh, the axe is made of as well, which is great. Uh, you can see all the armor and everything with uh, all that non-metallic metal there on the chest. This lovely bone work done on the various areas of the skulls. It would not be a corn model, uh, let alone a demon prince without absolutely buckets of uh, skulls across the miniature. Um, and if we just move around, you can see this flesh. We'll just have a better look at some of the flesh from the rear. Uh, so if we look at this angle here, you can see uh, the beautiful non-metallic metal silver that's been done just on this chain here and this sort of uh, like almost kind of knuckle duster kind of thing a uh, bit, bit more excessive than a knuckle duster but um, but really really cool non-metallic metal that's been done on there uh, and then you can see this beautiful flesh here with those lovely subtle purple undertones and exquisite sort of blue sort of colorways on some of the veins and things purpley blue which I think is great uh, he's obviously destroyed wings with that sinew and chains that are all just put on there as well which is just awesome uh, obviously Scarabrand's got a very cool background so if you're unfamiliar with that uh, you definitely need to check him out we'll put a link to lexicanum in the uh, description of this video to scale around because you've got to check that out um, and just about his background um, and again you can see obviously that lovely skin work there they've got the leather just on that sort of uh, I say the leathery coppery hide there just on that sort of um, cornate detailed uh, sort of strap for uh, the uh, massive sort of uh, the sort of flail hammer thing that he's got I'll show you that shortly uh, this really cool corn axe uh, just on the base here as if he's just used that and uh, thrown that down for a second you've got a head that's just been uh, uh, sort of uh, caught there on the edge of the blade and it's just stuck to the blade quite a bit um, if we move around this side as well you'll see some more of this beautiful flesh work that's been done uh, and the non-metallic metal parts of the armor as well across the miniature uh, again this axe is absolutely beautiful uh, for, for a corn axe it's, it's absolutely stunning uh, so if I then move this angle this a little bit just so you can see uh, you've got this incredible kind of uh, mace hammer thing that he's got obviously it's, it's uh, got a little bit of movement on it um, but uh, it's all firmly firmly glued in place and if I just tilt the miniature so you can have a look at it uh, it's just an a super aggressive piece of kit that uh, only Scarabrand would use. Uh, this awesome base as well here. We've got this kind of like urban kind of rubbled base, which I think just is really nice and desaturated from such a, a quite a vibrant miniature with the flesh and the, uh, the sort of gum on the axe and the sort of sinew on the skin to have this lovely desaturated base, which just takes nothing away from the miniature and just uh, kind of frames it at the bottom half quite nicely. Um, but overall, a, a beautiful 
beautiful rendition of Scarabrand uh, painted to our platinum competition standard, if that makes sense. Uh, so do hope that you like it ever so much and you can see the amount of sheer hours that are invested into what goes into a platinum job here with us at Siege and what you get for a platinum job. It's a model which uh, you will never want to part ways with and will take pride of place on your uh, on your display shelf or cabinet. Uh, again, we'll just look at the front of, uh, of Scarabrand again here so you can see that really cool uh, sort of uh, face that he's got with that kind of damaged and destroyed side and then obviously you've got that really cool sinew and skin side of the face uh, do absolutely love the uh, the really tiny little pink uh, pinkly purple sort of eye all the texture and stuff that's been painted on the tongue of his face as well uh, in his mouth uh, it's got loads of texture just on that tongue there which is quite cool um, and again every little bit of detail on this beautiful model uh, has had hours and hours and hours invested into it so uh, I do hope that you like it ever so much uh, what an absolute beautiful piece uh, that's now going to be sent off to our client I do hope you like it ever so much uh, and if you are interested in a uh, platinum character then feel free to head to our website and uh, drop us a quote inquiry contact form which will be great um, as ever blood for the blood god and skulls for the skull throne uh, Scarabrand is now off to ransack and pillage thank you for watching the video guys I will see you very soon on the next one take care of yourselves and have a good day bye bye So thanks for watching the video guys, I hope that you have enjoyed it. While you're here on YouTube, help us out by subscribing to the Siege channel. We upload at least three videos a week, so make sure you hit that bell icon to be notified when a new video is live. To see more, go follow us on our other social media where you can keep up to date with what we get up to and interact with us. If you're looking to learn from us, we offer online tuition on Patreon and physical classes nationally in the UK. Finally, to get your free quote today, click the link in the description of this video. From all the team here at Siege and myself, a massive thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.